Hey guys, so I got a juicer build for you today. Now, this is the build I've been using for No Hope. I'm able to pretty much solo carry the majority of it. Uh, it's a shotgun, uh, pyro, nade build hybrid. It, it, it's all over the place. Um, so to put you through my mindset, uh, I have 50% accuracy because that's the accuracy I like with attack, uh, personally. Um, glass cannon for that damage. Um, then you got Pyro with the for, for the piñata. You're spawning everything. Um, Defibs, medkits, pain kills, uh, every accessory in the game. And it also works with uh, any accessory. So barbed wire kills also drops um, the accessories. Um, then I run improvised explosives and demolition extras for the extra damage on my mollies and my nades. Um, so that allows me to pretty much uh, kill bosses really quick um, if I don't trust my team enough to be able to kill them. And since I play with mostly randoms, um, usually they can't kill the, the, the bosses in a good amount of time. So it keeps on spawning hordes and hordes and hordes and eventually they get overwhelmed. Um, I run, I like to, there's some interchangeable cards, uh, Mad Dash and Bomb Squad. So if my team doesn't run Shredder, I, I, I swap out mad dash for shredder um i like to try to get everyone to run bomb squad for for that extra nade damage and it also helps them um receive less damage from explosives as well um that's pretty much it um thanks for watching the video guys and peace out